Caustic is more of like a like a really overpowered defensive and aggressive character. Gibby is just like in every way possible you can you can do so much with Gibby. You can play defensive with him. You can play aggressive with him. You can make a mistake. Like even with Caustic, honestly, you can do the same thing. You can make you can fuck up and get down and just throw barrels on every door if you're in a building and just get a res off, you know? Like like I don't know, you we can just all agree that Valkyrie, Gibby, Caustic, those three characters are one of the most crutch characters on in this game. And like ever since Gibby became meta, this game has been like just gone to shit. Um, I don't think Valk like Valk wouldn't be that good if without Gibby. Like, I I, I don't really mind Valk compared to me like Gibby characters, or, like the Gibby um like Gibby players or whatever. Like Gibby, Gibby can stall and just like re like imagine. So like let's just imagine here, right? So I'm playing construction. Oh no, let's let's give a give a better example. So, let's say I'm playing. Um, I'm playing broken building. I'm playing second floor and first floor, and I down a player somehow on the side of the building here, right? If I if I down somebody here on the side of the building, it's like very late game. It's like it's like zone five, zone four, whatever the fuck. It's uh going down to top eight. I just down a guy. You know, it's maybe Casa Gibby Valkyrie team. I probably down the Valk on the side of the building here, and I'm second floor broken, first floor broken. If if they don't have a Gibby, I kill them all. I kill them all because like the amount of time that Gibby can like stall and buy time is just like st is stupid. It's like insanely stupid. Like it, you, the buy time, like you res, he heals, the bubble goes away. You have Gibby all to stall. You have, you even have caustic barrels. Like, you can play like sh such like you you can have such bad positioning and get away with it. Compared to like old meta, like if you if you play like if you messed up once, you're just dead. Like I don't know, you wouldn't like if people people wouldn't understand completely how much like the meta is like very casual and it's not like maybe I'm. Like maybe people would say, "Oh, I would, I want to be bitching if we were doing good, right? Whatever, right?" But like, I think reality is like, all the old meta. Yes, it was boring and it was like kind of one-dimensional or whatever. But I think it really showcased so many aspects of a team. Like so many, like p like positioning, IGLing, gun skill. There was no like. I fuck up and I can just dome. I fuck up, I throw my caustic uh, ulti. I fuck up, I throw barrels, etc. You know? We're in game 7, I think? No, 8 actually. Game 8, there's 5 on match point. 5 teams on match point. It's, it looks like a countdown zone, possibly. Do you think having a Watson is a good counter for Gibby and Crypto? I don't know. I haven't like really played Watson that much. It's probably a good counter for Crypto, but I don't know about Gibby. Because like... Like these comps that I see in like Apex North, I feel like we just wouldn't fly in North America. People wouldn't let, like people won't let it like slide. Because I think I think the only reason why Watson and like the only reason why Watson and Crypto, I think the only reason why like characters like Watson and Crypto are really like popular in this region is because they play so passive. So like if you put yourselves like if you if you put characters like the, like passive characters in an aggressive region like NA, you're just gonna get rolled. I don't. I think North America is the most aggressive region. Al, if you, if you, and both of you, if you guys had, other than yourself, if you had to assemble three players that you, like, you know, you wanted to get the best results in a tournament out of, who would you pick? Three players. From Not any, re in, in, in any regions? Only. NA only. I'd probably put Sweet as IGL. Sweet, Lou, and... Who am I third? Nathan, I guess? Sweet Lou, Nathan? 
I don't know, like, actually I don't even know, because Sweet and Lou might conflict, because I know Lou likes, wants to IGL on Gibby, so that might not even work. Nah, I mean, we played together, me, him, and Lou. So. But was he like that before? Well, I think Lou's, I think Lou's always kind of, like, given ideas and shit, but when when he played, when me, him, and Sweet played, he just listened to Sweet, because he knows that Sweet's, like, a really good idea. Bro, everyone is just, look at Riddle, is that Riddle duo or a trio down there? Duo. Oh my god. Everyone's just like, Baoko cool thing onto each other. What the fuck is he doing? He thought he was about to join their team. I thought he was. I, th I think he thought he was a Valk. He started fucking flying. <laughs> that dude thought he was about to just straight chill in the loot boxes. Citizen, thanks for the gift. My man was like, I'm gonna transfer my soul into the drone and start flying away. <laughs> it showed like Flora as that in Riddle. Oh, that's an egg. Oh, Flora's about to No shot right now. Ooh, wait. wait, isn't that Riddle down below? Oh my god, it is. It's some duo. They win. Wait, no, it's fucking the reject. It's reject. No way, bro. Regis is on match point now. That's another game, bro. That's game. Yeah, Regis is at 60. There's six teams now. Crazy Raccoon still is not. They were at 47 last game and they're still at 47. Oh my god. How much? You, I'm betting that Reject wins the tournament.